And today we have a special thing. So I live in a place where we have a company vehicle and this is it. The 2022 Chrysler Pacifica Touring L. This is replacing a 2010 Chrysler Town & Country with 125,000 miles on it. This one has just under 45,000. So let's take a look at the seating. All right, now the key fob, this is the key. Little focus, come on, there we go. Lock, unlock, remote start, power tailgate, and the sliding doors. Sliding doors. The remote start. So, you just press the lock, and then just press this two times. Honks twice, starts right up. And turn it back off. Boom. Let's, let's check out the interior. So there are a couple ways to open up the van. There is the conventional way where you just pull it. But with this one, you can also do this. Voila. Now see, it can seat up to eight, but this one does not have the, the optional middle row, which honestly I kind of preferred it not to have. So at a glance, this is nice. USB and USB-C. So I can charge my computer while I'm in the back here. Now, legroom is fantastic. Second row also gives you a, a cup holder and some storage. You can have just the cup holders showing. You can have it all hidden. I don't know if this is removable or not. Now the third row, this, it's like a couch. My friend, my friend told me that he's like, Wow, there's so much space back here. It's like a, almost a couch. And that's where that went, so, hmm. I have to figure out how to fix that. So, but now, the Chrysler Town & Country, the legroom, you didn't have any, but this, oh, I can spread out and I can lay down. I can just relax and, oh, uh, and it's more comfortable than the Town & Country. It's nicer, so, now, to get out of the van from the third row, it's a way you can, besides doing the center, I can just do this. And same to get back in. Now, if I'm wanting to put the rear seats, the second row seats into the floor, um, there is a button for me to push the second row, the first the driver's seat, just enough. So I can open this. Yep. So there are apparently 243 ways that you can configure this. So, and I'm very curious of what all 243 are. So I'm gonna have to figure that out have is that the storage area down there is not as deep as the, as the town and country. This is a little more shallow and I have boots on the other side, but I managed to get them in there, but there was just more room in the other one. So, but I can't complain. Whoop. Turning up the 2022 Chrysler Pacifica, put your foot on the brake and put the and push button, which is down here, which kind of covers, it, Rolls right up to life. And, now I wish the push button was up here because it's easier to see and it's not like hidden. So, we can you, we can see that this car has 44,933 miles. And uh, don't worry, we just got an oil change because uh, it came with one. Um, I'm gonna turn it over to you. system. This one does not have navigation, but And I, I can turn on my heated steering wheel. And it heats up very quickly. And it's very nice, and I love that. So, and that, that does that. Now, e-brake. So I'm gonna show you the backup camera now. Just turn this. The backup camera it has the turn trajectory. I mean, it's a little grainy, but other... Like, it's still in really, it's a good kind. 
See, we've been driving this for a couple days now, and we've put almost 100 miles on it, and we're getting 22.4 miles to the gallon. The Chrysler Town & Country, it got, well, 15, and that was pretty bad. So the display setup has the touchscreen, screen, the theme, so the lighting mode, so right now it's in light mode because it's light out, units, I can change uh, the distance from miles to kilometers, so like this. So watch the tachometer. 72,314 kilometers. 44,933 miles. Now that's very nice if you go to Canada. Window sticker. Um, this is all the features that we got. Price was lower online. It was at twenty six nine ninety five, which is not bad for a car like this. I like the feel of it. It's very comfortable and very smooth. If you think about getting a, a Chrysler Pacifica, I recommend it. Thank you for watching the video, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.